You don't go to Krishna with a calculator in your hand. No, it will collapse. That's why Srila Siddhar Maharaj will say that the type of bhakti in Vrindavan is called Gyan Sunya Bhakti. And Brahma already spoke about that in the beginning of his prayers. And Srila Siddhar Maharaj will translate Gyan Sunya Bhakti as brain dead bhakti. <laughs> it doesn't mean that don't think. It means you, you have exhausted the capacity of thinking and you have reached a place where thinking will be an impediment to what's actually taking place there. That will be an unnecessary weapon. <laughs> that will be a disturbing ingredient in the lila. Mm -hmm. Because what, what's taking place there is beyond thinking. Mm -hmm. That's a different, difficult thing to say, to, 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 to even accept, because generally we are so much attached to our thinking, our thinking processes, to our ideas, to how we process reality through our head. And, and, and to accept that there is a plan with that's not required, the high, higher laws are operating there. That's challenging, and of course, it's a gradual process of, of surrender. And one of the best ways to do that is to use all those functions again in the best possible way here in the service of Krishna till they show us their limitations and the entrance of grace and bhakti samskars allow us to move and operate with another values, when there is no longer need to think that much.